Oh, C. Okay, so we have to try that with C again. Hang on, hang on. Oh, oh crap. Sorry, sorry. Greetings, guys and girls and fellow gamers. My name is games for cakes and welcome back to 7 Days to Die Alpha 17 Experimental. I'm gonna record this intro after we actually finished with our episode, so sorry about that, but um, I forgot to record before I start the stream. Um, was really cool we actually have to increase production yeah because we tried desperately to grind more and more stone more for cement it's just not happening fast enough so we need more resources we need more um tools to do things with and anyway so it's i hope you guys are gonna have a good time with the episode okay no matter what we do but it's gonna definitely be focusing on trying to get more and more resources done quicker because we want to get that house done before day 14 and it's only like a day and a half left now or something so we are in a time pressure to get everything upgraded anyway i hope you guys have a good time watching the episode if you do remember to kick that like button in the balls to support the channel and if you're new to the channel and you like what you see hit that subscribe button so let's get started this is delicious. We have already. Hello, guys. Want to level me up to level 41, I see. That is very nice of you. And listen, guys, no touches on the base. Okay, I literally just finished upgrading it. So there's no touches on the base. Oh, that is, that is nice. That is nice. There you go. This is going to be loads of XP. We're going to get up to level 42, potentially. There you go, and stamina is flowing. Sta oh, you're holding your arm. What are you, a human? A humane? A humane that feels pain? Oh, okay. Oh, okay, N now we're back to missing. I think I literally, I'm convinced this is the game cheat going into cheat mode, where it goes like, hey, we haven't hit that human in at least 15 hits, so we're going to need to make sure that he misses the next attack. Okay, that's it, there you go. Loads of dead bodies. And bam! There we go. And loads more experience. Yeah, our stamina is doing fine. Our stamina is doing fine. And a little bit more. There we go. Nearly done. <laughs> this is insane. I love it. I love it. We just freshly topped up on our stamina and everything, so we're doing okay. There you go. Sorry, I'm not gonna wait for you to get back up. There you go. Nice. And we're nearly level 42. That was insane. I think we started at level 40 or something. Oh, night vision goggles. I love you, man. I love you. So if we wear them, now I was told that... There you go. There you go. Nice. That is insane, Rooney, because it means now that we don't have to work with the Gamma anymore. We can wear these now. And yes, so now we can say we want Mining Helmet. Or Night Vision. Or Mining Helmet. Okay, so I assume whatever you have on first is going to be the F default key. So if we take everything off. So we put the Mining Helmet on. There you go, it's on and off with the light. If we put the night vision goggles on now. Oh, okay, it moves to switch. Okay, it switches to night vision goggles. And if we want the light on and off, we have to go onto this. Okay, I get it, I get it, I dig it. That's good, that's good. I like it, I understand. That actually makes sense. Okay, so this is really lovely. So we got loads of experience to start. And um, now we're gonna go and make some more concrete and upgrade all our walls, dude. They have to be upgraded. Oh, oh, oh. Does anybody else have that? Every now and then, I think it's after you log in fresh, when this is closed, you have to click it twice to open it. When you click it the first time, it makes the noise, but then you have to click it the second time to open. It's really weird. I have to pay more attention to that. And I just had a gentle reminder that the crossbow is something I can craft and I should try out. Now, I'm in per my personal opinion, or sorry, not opinion, my personal thought or guess is that my compound bow still does more damage than the crossbow. But I'm most likely wrong, so I think we should definitely try crafting it. Like, that that's a good idea, because an upgrade is an upgrade. Um, do we have any forged iron? I thought I had more forged iron on me. Where did I put all my forged iron? Oh, I put it in here. Yeah, that's not where it belongs, dude. That's why that's why I can't find it. Actually, I don't have to count it. I have it already in my inventory. Okay, so we need some leather. And we need that. And we need some glue. 
I have glue. Beautiful. And we only have one tape. Um, but, 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 oh, we only need one duct tape. Okay, we can make more. We have bones. We have loads of water source. And what else do we need? We need two glue. Okay, that's no problem. That's no problem. We have another one here. And we need wood. We have it. Excellent. Okay, let's craft it. It means only 55 seconds. And um, then we'll see. And I actually, I found... Um, Towards the end of the last episode, I, I was looting um, off camera or after the uh, last episode, and I got some steel crossbow balls. So, seeing that I have some steel arrows as well, I think we can do a nice comparison. Yes, we can do a nice comparison now. And we also gonna repair that. So that way we have a 100% uh, repaired. There you go. Excellent. Oh, it's not repairing while it's crafting. That's interesting. It doesn't. It does do that with some things. When you when you repair this, or this, it does that. Yeah, I repair this and it does it. You see that? Bam! Straight in there. But it doesn't do it um, for repairing another weapon. Okay, so we have this crossbow here now. So let's put the steel arrows in here. That's steel arrows. And let's put the steel crossbow bolts in here. Okay, so they're both steel. Now let's see what damage we have. This one does 45. It doesn't do a lot of more damage, but it has a higher velocity. So which I am assuming means um, it can shoot further? Or it's faster reaching its target? Interesting. Yeah, so I think I'm going to use up all the arrows and anything new I'm crafting, I will be crafting um, the crossbow. The, the crossbow bolts, yeah. That makes sense. Actually, that was very good. Thank you so much for letting me know about that. Because I was kind of like, nah, it's a compound bow, which usually is a bit stronger than the crossbow anyway. Um, depending what level, I suppose. So we're going to keep these guys here. We're going to take all our arrows and waste them. <laughs> and see what we can do. What else do we need? Let me see. I think this is close here. There we go. We found some goggles, night vision goggles, which is good. Our intellect should still be okay. Yeah, we're still okay. We're still okay. Grease monkey. You can craft mini bikes. So we can craft the mini bike now as well, which, except for storage, I don't think has a benefit over the bicycle. Well, I think it can have mods, but there's no mods for vehicles in the moment as far as I know. So the mini bike benefit over the bicycle is it's still as slow as the bicycle, but it doesn't cost you stamina. And well, the stamina is kind of redundant because it, it fills up quicker than it can use it. And it has a bigger storage. So that's the next step, I suppose. Chemistry stations, standard ammunition, alcohol, pipe bombs, hook cup. Oh, okay. That would actually be a good point spent, I would say. Hmm. Yeah, the chemistry station is booked as well. So we have the chemi station that we can craft, which we're supposed to craft now. And that's booked and the saw is booked. So what I was deciding is that I will just have the materials and I will just spawn in that stuff and exchange it for the materials. I just won't get the experience for crafting it. Simple as that. But um, I don't have an issue spawning that in and just dropping the materials for it, um, you know, into the creative menu. So they're gone. And anyway, so we're going to need a lot of concrete mix. So we're going to need to get out. And that's only 35 blocks. We need about 40 more. And we need a lot more forged iron as well. So I have to make sure I queued some up. And we need about 400 forged iron. So that is going to be a task and a half to keep on top of. There we go. No iron. We have enough clay. There you go. There's more iron. 80, that's 220, and then we have this here, that's, ooh, okay. We're getting there, we're getting there, we're getting there. Okay, let's go outside, let's go do a bit more grinding and get more resources, and then we're gonna be able to um, hopefully upgrade everything to concrete. Apparently we can jump with our bike, so. Oh, it's C, okay, so we have to try that with C again. Hang on, hang on. Oh, oh crap. Sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry, I know it's a pickaxe, it's not the right tool, but you know what, whatever works. Um, let me fix this. <laughs> there we go. I think it's, 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 the bike makes sense to pick up, but um, 
Let me just put this down here. Thank you. Come on. Let's put these guys back in there. Okay, so let's see. Nurse, I have to jump in your face. Where are you? <laughs> I love this. This is too funny. And we're not losing any stamina jumping, which is really odd. I mean, how many times does it actually take to kill a zombie? Let's see. And do we get the experience points from it? Okay, that's three. Four. Is she dead? No. Five. Six. She's still not dead. Wow. Okay, how many does it take? Oh, that sounded like death. That sounded like death. That sounded like death. <laughs> I just got run over by my own bike. Okay, it didn't count. So we killed her with our bike and we didn't get experience. I suppose in a way that makes sense because they don't want you to take a jeep or something and go like completely ham on the zombies and, you know, hort night and kill all the zombies in a jeep and get like the experience. I mean, it makes sense, you know? Yes, yes, yes. I know. It's like, oh, ah, the effort. Ah. Okay, I'm going to get a little bit more stone. We have to, we need a lot more stone. We need more sand. We need more concrete. We need about another 500 concrete or so. And we need more forged iron, so we have to get a lot more iron. Alright, we just spent a flippin' huge amount of time on gathering resources. Uh, loads of rocks, loads of um, digging up. So we got now several thousand stone, 801 um, snow, I nearly said. Sand. There you go. You hear that? That was opened. And now it's second time. It's funny. I think when it closes automatically after a while, that's when it's actually not closing. It's just visually closed. And when you come then to open it, it actually closes it. And I think that's what the noise is you hear. Okay, so let's see what we have. Cement. We need to put more cement. Oh, yeah, cement is downstairs. They're the same thing again here. See, I leave them open. I think they're closed by themselves after a while and they just don't register as closed. That's, that's what I think the problem is. Um, okay, so let's put more frames in here. We need the time. Okay, forged iron. How much? 43. Okay, let's do this. Let's put this in here and more clay. 5, 10. Yeah, okay, let's do this. And um, cement. 77. Okay, do you know what? Let's put... There you go. All right. Okay, so we're gonna ha we have our forge shine. Now, we don't have 400 yet, but we need approximately 400 because we need to make 100... Metal spikes. So let me see. Okay, so how much do we have on concrete here? That is all our concrete. We have 35. So let's go to the back wall because the back wall is what I started already upgrading. And I think we can finish the back wall at least. There you go. Okay, how many do we have left? 24 so this we can upgrade now a second time so the back of the wall is now reinforced concrete and concrete so that's interesting now so we should start probably upgrading um, over here now and we have seven more balls and that's it excellent okay so we're gonna be able to make a full round upgrading everything twice i'm not so sure probably not from the time perspective well it's only day 12 so a lot of things can still happen yeah so we need to make some food and some drink 
And then um, I'm not sure what we're going to do because we still need to grind more. But I'm kind of itching for a bit of looting. So we might actually check up this direction here and go to this place and have a loot run on that, I think. Now, the forge is very slow. It's it's very slow. So i um, taking resources. So there was a, the a suggestion made to make another forge. I don't know if I have all the resources for it. We need bellow. We need a bellow. So which is we have the wood, we have the pipes. Great. So all we need is the leather, which is 20. I think we have just about enough leather. Yeah, actually, that's we, we have just about enough leather. So let's make two. Why not? Why not? Okay, so now four Jeroonies. We need six, 60 clay. We have that. We have the bellows. We have the pipes. And we have the stone. Excellent. There we go. Make two of them. We can make one in the forge. I think we can make one in here. I think we can make one in here. And then we can make the other one on our person. There you go. One being made. It's only 28 seconds. Okay, so then it's not a big whoop. Okay. Yeah, we can endure that. Actually, let's eat something and drink something because we're doing awful with food right now. So um, I want to get rid of that all first and leave the good meat. We need about four of them because they're 10 each. There we go. And we need a little bit of drink. Okay, that should do it. That should get everything come up now um, to the right levels. And we might need also a bandage. There we go. There we go. Let's put the forges... I don't know. Let's put them here. And... Um, we can make an anvil downstairs. So right now, stone, 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 cement, cement, cement. Get stone in here. There we go. There's the other forge. You hit the forge, didn't you? Yes, you did. Asset. Okay, excellent. Now we have some more concrete mix here. We have loads of sand, so we should be okay. Now we need more stone. Where's my bicycle? Crap. Ah, balls. Where to live my bicycle? Bikey! I left you behind. Oh, there you are. You're not that far. That's okay. Yeah, we're gonna have to go on another grind, Bikey. We're gonna have to find more small rocks. Um, There's not really clusters anymore, isn't there? Oh, there's loads here. Wow. Okay, that's a big cluster right there. We're gonna go right there. Okay, I think we have a bit of a problem here. There's a horde running at us. But I think I turned the light off just in time. They were just running past over there, but I had the lights on, so I'm not sure. Where's Bikey? Where's my bike? There. Okay, we have to go back to my bike. Ooh. Hello? They run all past. No way. That would be just too awesome. Where's our bike? There. There's some rocks here, so we can continue. Okay. Yes. Oh, that was close. I just saw loads of heads all of a sudden running this direction. I'm like, oh crap, we have the light on. They're gonna see me. <sighs> Man, give me a heart attack, lady. Don't do that. Okay, I think we got it now. Okay. <sighs> I 
Abwehr. Okay, Abwehr, okay. Might as well leave the lights on. So we're gonna get attacked. Anyway. No, she's not in pain. That's just her chopping stone. We're getting cold, but that's okay. Okay, with the two forges now that we made extra um, and the stone in them, hopefully we can make faster cement. I have another over 1000 stone now with me that hopefully will be enough to make the action concrete mix from that cement and then just keep filling it up again to make more cement. But it should be fast. There was two forges, well, it was three forges in total now. Um, well, the heat map is probably going to be all over the shop. But it should be now a lot faster to get cement done in concrete mix, hopefully. Look at Bunny Hop. That's so funny. <laughs> and it doesn't take any energy. Oh, crap. Ah, balls. I went right into a hole where... Yeah, come on. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. And, and, and. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. You can... No, you can't do it. You suck. You suck. There you go. All right. I run home. Fair enough. It's quicker anyway. It's right there. So... <laughs> Okay, let's check out the forge, but I think that's pretty much it um, on uh, resources I can gather for the night. Because I keep getting attacked now, so... Let's see what's going on. Our heat map is actually okay, it's not too bad. Um, here we go, here's our forges. Um, let's make cement. Oh, yes, baby, that's what I'm talking about. Nice, look at that, beautiful. You just keep giving me that cement, baby. There you go. And what is this forge doing down there? Nah. Oh yes, now we're talking. Good, good. Let's put some more iron in here. Very good, I like it. So we definitely have enough... Um... Enough cement now. And then we have 1,200, so we can make another 1,200, which means it's 120 upgrades we can do which should be fine that should be fine all right guys i'm gonna leave this episode here that was something else um we had the nighttime uh, grind um again a lot of it is off camera um, because it's just like me hitting rocks over and over and the resources are so little now you actually can gather four or five in-game hours and you come home with very little so um it's a lot more grind we luckily got the forges going and we're gonna be able to increase productivity that way we're gonna be able to make like over 2000 cement hopefully um by morning and then turn that into concrete mix and hopefully go from there we're gonna we're gonna dig up more stuff here for more sand and uh, stone and that hopefully will be enough um day 14 fingers crossed we're gonna have all those spikes upgraded to metal and all those walls upgraded to at least concrete if not even reinforced concrete but that that's only a dream come true anyway i hope you guys had a good time watching the episode if you did remember to kick that like button in the balls and i hope i see you guys in the next video and if you're new to the channel and you liked what you've seen hit that subscribe button and see you guys next time until then as always feel spaß and happy gaming and one of the things we can still do is we can upgrade these guys to steel uh, to iron okay ah balls we need what we need what we need what yeah, we do not need to walk ourselves over the spikes that would be great oh wow i stepped on it a little bit and i got destroyed so fast they see wow that is so much health loss that is insane